setting. Um, I realized this house was built somewhere in the 1800s, around when my parents got married. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to start this off uh, by doing what I did when I found out Andrew was engaged. <laughs> okay. I would like to point out that mine is not off Google and it's not scripted. If I saw anything more scripted, you might as well call these two Melania Trump. <laughs> Trip. Love you boys. And, oh, and there we go, guys. That's the one here. Gas, keep your shirt on. Um, as most of you know, um, I'm not going to rev this up as much as I did the roast and whistler about a month back. So this can be a little softer, like Andrew's barking. Go so, hard. Um, I'm also going to take this uh, time to point out this is not going to be about Natalie because, let's face it, life, some things in life are too easy. Oh! To chirp, to chirp now. Amazing older brother, um, teaching me everything I know in life, except for anything important. <laughs> Ian, always been there to motivate me, even though he's my younger brother. But uh, just wanted to say thanks to you guys for uh, everything you've done for me in the past. One thing is different, that I make this suit look good. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, again, for the what, third, fourth time now, thank you everyone for making out to this beautiful scenery. Um, and there I'm out of here and making out this wonderful occasion of uh, celebrating this speech as a wedding secondary. <laughs> um, what I'm looking at here is not actually my speech, it's just the drink menu for after so if you're in the corner. <laughs> um, as most of you know, um, <laughs> as most of you know, uh, over the years of getting to know Andrew, how long have you known him, if it's the first time you've met him or known him for years, it's a bit of a softie. Um, Andrew, um, He's a bit of a drama queen. <laughs> Still a bit. I mean, if he had any more career-ending toe injuries on the tennis court, if he had any more uh, career-ending toe injuries on the tennis court, Terry Fox offered to lend a leg. Incredibly nervous over this past week. Um, I'm totally stressed out, which is completely understandable. Um, but on a serious note, you've done all you can. It's been an excellent, excellent weekend, as everyone already knows. Um, over this past week, as Andrew's been so nervous, his panties weren't any more of a bunch. My cousin John Romanko, another firefighter of mine, uh, is me. Um, I'm happy to get the jaws of life out just a little bit. <laughs> Um, but seriously, but seriously, Andrew, this is Mel, this is Mel, I left a lot of this, uh, as I did, I worked in the shower last night, so this is all written in a matter of 10 minutes or so. Um, Andrew, just, just right now, just calm down, I know this has been a really nervous week for you, which I completely agree with, it's a big day for you. Um, right now, all I want you to do with me is just take a breath of fresh air. Come on, smell us. That's freedom going out the window. <laughs> Ha, <laughs> ha, 
But on a uh, serious note, at the end, uh, wishing you and your bride, Natalie, um, a happy life. Uh, Natalie, you found a good one. Um, so thank you again, everyone. Thank you for being here. It's a big day for our family and, and the listeners. Um, thank you again for being here. Love you, Andrew. So thanks for everything. Woo!